and my thoughts keep telling me to get me home, but my thoughts keep telling me to let me oh, oh, just let me home. How's it going lads? Marshall here and welcome to another Team of the Season player review. Now today it's Zero Immobile. I was going to bring Team of the Season Moreno review out for you guys today, but over this weekend I haven't been very well. So I've went back and brought out the Zero Immobile one that I did promise for you guys. Don't worry, the Moreno one will come soon. And if you do want some coins to buy Immobile, head over to FUT Coins to go and use the code M89 to get yourself 5% off. Now the new Dortmund striker, he's going for 30k on the Xbox One, 35 on the PlayStation 4. This card is a major improvement on any other versions of Immobile's card on the game. I think that's how you pronounce his name by the way. I'm not too sure. It's just how the commentators pronounce him on the game. Zero Immobile. I, it might be called Immobile. I just really don't know. Now in terms of stats, fantastic. You see his finishing was very, very high. And um, yeah, physical attributes. He got good acceleration, great agility, great sprint speed and fantastic strength. Aggression wise, not the best in the world, but it does doesn't matter, he's going to win the ball in the air 9 times out of 10. Now I reviewed this guy whilst I was reviewing Can Drave, I can say that properly, and this guy really did stand out, but he is very one dimensional. In the air, he's going to win you a lot. On the grounds, not so much, his dribbling's not exactly the best in the world, 2 star skills does not help, and he lives up to his name which um, when translated into English, or just uh, moved across into English, means immobile, not able to move properly, and um, yeah he does live up to that. So he's movement isn't the best in the world. I don't know what that guy was doing defensively in that situation, but um, Immobile does score another goal. So he's pros. Strength, fantastic. This guy is a workhorse. He's a battering ram. He is just so damn good in the air and on the ground, holding up the ball, letting others into the game, and he's just a great target man and a hold-up player. Heading fantastic. You can see some heading goals right now. Fantastic in the air and he does score time after time with his bonds. And he's finishing this fantastic as well. I think you've already seen that on this game as he scores another header. Shot power is sensational and his price, 30k for an inform or a team of the season I should say is sensational. He's just a cracking little player guys and you can go try him out. Like I said, he is very one dimensional similar to any other kind of tall player with a lack of pace. I say a lack of pace, he is actually quite fast but the dribbling does affect him as you see. Another nice little piece of play and El Shawari does score the goal. So for me, he does get a 7 out of 10. He is very limited but he's still a cracking player guys if you have enjoyed this smash the hell out the thumbs up button it always does help if you haven't already subscribed drop a sub catch you all next time